so hello students uh, in this question you are seeing uh, in triangle pqr right angled at q here it is given a right angled at q so this is pqr pr plus qr equal to 25 this is one result and pq equal to 5 this is 5 cm these two we want to know as it is given pr plus qr equal to 25 in the result abdi irukku here using pythagoras theorem using pythagoras theorem we know pr squared equal to pq squared plus qr squared we want qr first so qr squared equal to pr squared minus pq squared here pr plus qr so that you can find pq pq and the already we know phi squared here yeah. so this can be written as pr squared equal to phi squared plus qr squared so 25 plus qr squared this is pr squared pr plus qr so pr squared minus qr squared equal to 25 this is a squared minus b squared yeah so a plus b into a minus b so this you can write it as pr plus qr then pr minus qr equal to 25 pr plus qr you can write it as 25 so 25 bracket then pr minus qr equal to 25 therefore 25 25 will be cancelled so pr minus qr equal to 1 25 by 25 1 so we have two result pr plus qr equal to 25 pr minus qr equal to 1 so adding 1 and 2 qr qr will be cancelled so 2 pr equal to 26 therefore pr equal to 26 by 2 equal to 13 so pr or value 13 here we got one answer and we want rq isn't it now take and substitute pr equal to 13 in one of the equation so pr uh, plus qr equal to 25 so instead of pr you are substituting 13 plus qr equal to 25 therefore qr equal to 25 minus 13 equal to 12 so 5 minus 3 here 12 so we know all the values of the side so that we can find sin p cos p and tan p so sin p here p means in the consider this angle isn't it so it is opposite sin p formula opposite by hypotenuse opposite 12 hypotenuse 13 so one answer then next is cos p adjacent side by hypotenuse so phi by 13 then tan p tan p opposite by adjacent so 12 by phi so this the half folds thank you so now question number 11 state whether the following statements are true or false justify your answer the value of tan a is always less than 1 it is false because we know tan 60 what is tan 60 degree tan 60 equal to root 3 root 3 is greater than 1 because root 3 value is 1 point approximately equal to 1.732 then secant a equal to 12 by to for some value of angle this is true because secant a secant value is always greater than 
greater than or equal to 1. Cos A is the abbreviation of cosecant A. That is wrong. That is false. Because it is the abbreviation of cosine A. It is the abbreviation of cosine A. Cot A is the product of cot and A. Cot and A. It is false because this is meaningless. Cot without any angle, without an angle is meaningless. You can't write this simply cot. So cot without A, angle A is meaningless. Then sin theta equal to 4 by 3 for some angle A. This is false because sin value always, sin theta value always less than 0 to 1. Minimum value 0, maximum value 1. Or you can write in this way. You know sin theta equal to opposite by hypotenuse. Here hypotenuse is always greater than 1. So a number by the greater number is less than 1. So in this way also you can write. So this is called. Thank you.